Hey yo, what's up guys? Norm here, and I'm back with another video. And today, Borderlands 3 just went crazy with all the new content. We have a limited time event for the next week, one less until May, and one less until June. I'm gonna have future videos in the next couple of hours on that, but for this video, I'm gonna show you guys the fastest way to get the pieces of uh, intel for the cartel so you can figure out what the hideout is. Hey, before I dive in, I wanna say thank you for the 700 subs. I really, really appreciate it. Coming from a small YouTuber, you guys made that possible. Like, you guys have been going crazy the last month. And I really, really appreciate it. So let's keep it going. So let's now let's dive into the video. All right. So the best way I found to get these pieces of intel fast was to head over to Heart's Desire. Heart's Desire is just a new uh, a new spot on the Zylorgas planet that was in DLC 2, Gloves and Love's Tentacles. So basically, once you're inside here, the very first two entrances where all the enemies spawn, you should be able to get all 30 pieces of uh, intel to find the cartel hideout. Now... Regular enemies do not carry the intel, of course, just to let you know that. But only certain enemies carry it. Now, the enemies that you see on the screen, when they flash that color of light, those are cartel enemies. If you see that name bar, it's going to say cartel, thug, cartel, whatever. And those are the ones that drop the intel. So those are the ones you kind of want to focus on. But pieces of advice, you basically just want to kill everybody in the room because you don't want to focus on certain enemies that end up dying because if you die, you got to start over and get all the pieces of um, intel again, I believe. But I never died, so I'm, don't quote me on that. So in the very first two entries, just kill everything, and once they stop spawning in a certain room, just move to the next room. So the very first two rooms should give you 15 pieces apiece, like easy. And then after that, what you want to go and do is you're going to head back to Sanctuary and give it back to Maurice. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Like, it's not hard, not complicated, fairly simple. I'm pretty sure there's other places you can get it, but I feel like this is one of the fastest ways, because it took me less than three minutes, easy. So that's pretty much it. If this video helped you, leave a like, sub. Like I said, I got future videos coming out today. Um, if you enjoyed the content, let me know. If you found a faster way, even let me know and put it in the comment section. And I'm going to catch you on the next one. Peace out, and thanks for watching.